the pound USD. I'm actually very proud and happy about my signal for the pound USD because it just went exactly literally as I mentioned in my midweek analysis video. I mentioned in the midweek analysis video that we can start shorting the pound USD right on this level 1.31498. You can go back to that video and watch it again and the reversal happened exactly on this level and I also said that you can exit your trade on this previous support and you can expect for the market to keep falling all the way down until it hit this previous resistance and then close your trade with profit and how how beautiful is it when you give the forecast and what you're saying has exactly happened I just want to see the faces of these people who said I'm a scammer or a fraud I just want to tell them what kind of a scammer can give this accurate analysis anyway uh, we can see that we have earned about 134 pips of profit in case you guys have entered the signal I gave you in the midweek analysis video uh, let's just see what will gonna happen next with the pound USD now after bouncing from this resistance uh, from this previous resistance right here we can see that the market has made all the way up like a pullback right now the market is reversing uh, because this is for our chart going to the daily candles we can see that the market seems to be exactly uh, going up all the way again reversing uh, from the support level because we can see that we have here a, a previous uh, resistance level ha and after this uh, breakout uh, sorry bullish breakout candle the market has kept its position so this resistance became a support I don't believe the market is gonna fall immediately uh, we can expect a reversal to happen at this uh, point and what I am expecting because we having here a resistance number one the market is gonna go up again hitting this level to create a resistance to and then from that point the market is gonna continue falling more down so let's see what will gonna happen let's go to the four hour chart again now on the four hour chart um, we can see that the market has made the reversal right on this level of the previous support and right now it is currently we are currently on a resistance on a support level because we can see that here we had a strong support level I said also before in the past when you see a support level consists of one long tail like that it's indicating a huge strength in the level a very this is a very strong support level and that is indicated by seeing what happened later in the future the support level here kept its position as a support and here also as well and right here and right here all happened on this candle here on this uh, long tail here therefore what's gonna happen next is after this bullish breakout candle this uh, support level is gonna keep its position as a support and therefore the pound USD should be good for the buy actually immediately and let me tell you something if you place your buy order you can expect for the pound USD to fall a little bit down to this level 1.30327 and um, because again as I said because here we have a support number one maybe the market will go down for support number two now I'm not telling you to place your buy order immediately here or wait for the market to go here I'm just giving you always the, the backup plan the, the, the plan B what are you going to do if the trade goes against you well that is your plan B if you see the market if you place your buy order right here um, don't panic because the market as I said might actually fall down to the support level and then it's gonna continue its bullish reversal therefore uh, the pound USD is actually good to buy immediately because we are on a very strong support level let me just uh, tell you buy uh, buy now for the pound USD right now where is the level on and expect for the market to go down uh, below for almost 26 or 28 pips and then at that point it's gonna reverse hopefully and you can exit your trade let me tell you where you should exit your trade uh, go back to the daily candles just to see the, the resistance level and this is right here perfect so go back to the four hour chart and let me tell you where you should close your trade because you are going to start shorting once the market reach that point and just I want to be uh, I want to be sure everyone is safe that's just to this level so you can buy the pound USD only for almost 64 pips and if you want to be even more safe 
you can ignore buying the pound USD. Wait for the market to reach this uh, level of the resistance and then place your buy order because I believe the pound USD is gonna continue uh, its bearish momentum all the way until it hit this previous support level. So again, pound USD is right now on a pullback. We are going to short the pound USD on this level and then keep shorting until here. So let me just uh, make it simple, more simple for you. Uh, pound USD is gonna good for the buy now. Uh, it depends on uh, where the market is gonna open on Monday morning, and then again sell the pound USD on level 1.31232. Let me just be sure because I always make mistakes uh, typing the numbers. 1.31232, correct. So you have two signals for the buy. Uh, sorry, for the pound USD. One is buy, another one is sell. Um, it is a good idea to, to buy the pound USD. However, don't keep it long for uh, for long time. It's just fine to scalp the pound USD, get out with some uh, quick uh, bucks. Uh, but mainly, we are waiting for the sell for or for the short and get ready for it because it seems like really good position to start shorting the pound USD. So in the end, um, I really wish it will be a good week for everyone, and I, I want to thank you guys for watching.